Are you handing me drugs? Yes, yes I am. Why are you handing me drugs? <laughs> Hi Chew. Hi Chew. So is it gum or candy? You'll see. Okay. You'll see. I don't like that. Is my mouth gonna <laughs> turn blue or something? Maybe purple. <laughs> Like, as soon as I chew this, am, am, am I gonna have like urges from men or something? <laughs> Maybe boys and men. <laughs> right when he was saying. <laughs> Castle Grayskull in there. See, since he is being that that guy, open your door. He is being that guy. Friday, which is today, eleven to seven. It is currently eleven seventeen. Not open. Not so, open. Yeah. I'm being that guy. He's being that guy. Hey, look who decided to join the party. Welcome to the lateness tour. Yeah, y'all call me late all the time. All the time. And he brought a little dark with him too. Look, look at that, look at that, y'all are late as hell. Late, late, late. <laughs>
Brasil. Mesco, Jam Master J. Wait a minute, wait a minute. How yeah. much? Forty doll hairs. Not bad. Mm -hmm. Oh look, I'm shaking the camera, you can't tell. <laughs> <laughs> not bad. Mm. Look at the shoes. I'm looking at the shoes, you know, they get that's not the real Adidas, but you know. I've never seen them in the wild. I might have to get that. Yeah. $40, yeah. Sweet. Wait, hold on. Yeah. Hold on to it for you. Y yes, please. Yep. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> Thank you.
I'm gonna show you what we first picked up at DFW Toy Stash. And I told Craig that if I saw it, I was going to get it, okay? And I saw it, and I got it. <laughs> I had to get it. I had to get it, but I had to get this. So yes, Rube the Great now has Mezco in his collection. Mezco, fucking Mezco. I didn't. I didn't think I was gonna get him. I didn't like how Mezco was with the with the cloth on the uh, bodies. How it was basically it was a, a legend mixed with Amigo to me. But this Popeye figure right here was dope. And if you notice this plastic still on here, dude had just got these in the store. And Craig bought one, and I bought one. <laughs> Actually, we both bought the same ones. Like at the time, we were at the we had the same type of haul. Like so, we both ended up buying something. Like from there, I'm like, fuck. I had to get it, especially this Popeye. I had to get this. This so. one was an absolute must-have. I had to get this, and I needed this for my music shelf, and I was so like, Craig found this. I was filming, and Craig was like, Hey, Rue, check this out. I'm like. Y'all don't y'all wouldn't see my reaction in the camera because I was filming. And that's the bad thing about this. I don't have the external monitor for my new my new setup yet, so I can't do this right here all the time, but I have another Mesco. <laughs> okay, so technically I did have some Mesco figures because I have the biggie that I bought last year. And that one is uh, a Mesco. This was the other Mesco. This is also another Mesco. So their hip hop series is what I, I always I wanted. I still want to get the rest of those Biggie figures. I want to get the Tupac figures. I want to get the other two. I need all of Run DMC. So yeah, if y'all see these, let me know because I am willing to do some willing and dealing and trading and some buying for these. These are dope. And this is brand new in the box. It's coming out the box. I wish they would have gave it to me cheaper, but this <laughs> this bad boy's coming out the box right next to Biggie. Right next to Biggie. I didn't like how they gave him the the bootleg Adidas. So, and yes, it's pronounced Adidas. It's not pronounced Adidas. It's Adidas. The last dude's last name is Adidas something. Adidasman or something like that. But um. At the end of this, we end up going to Dallas Vintage Toys. Of course, we always end up at DVT. And I picked up two things. One of them I picked up because I haven't seen this in stores, but I really wanted to get this figure for some stuff. So it's, yeah, I picked up a Halloween, the Michael Myers. Yes, I picked this up. I had to pick this thing up. So I have him in my possession now. I've been meaning to pick up some Jason figures and some Freddy Krueger figures, but I wanted to get this one right here. So I now have a Michael Myers figure in my collection. But the one I am most happy to get, and this is my childhood. This is the reason why we collect because it's, it's something from our childhood. I mean, don't you think about it? Like our childhood is what spawn us and you could probably see what i have in my hand but it spawns us to what we do now like we remember having like the nostalgia of seeing something that you had as a kid and now it's like oh my god i remember having this kid i remember it takes you back to a simpler time and that's one reason why we collect and i think the feet are on back his name is short stack <laughs> and he's uh, uh <laughs> look at this Look at this, look at that, look at how dope that is. Oh my God. Okay, so I remember these, these are the late 80s. And I remember having a bunch of these as a kid. And the last time Craig and I were at DVT, we were there with Cincy, I believe that was in October. And I saw it in his video. His video was done before mine. And I saw in his video like, oh, we missed some food fighters in there. And I pointed out, he was like, oh, are you serious? We missed them because you know, Craig and I, that's stuff that we both grew up on and it's something that we would have wanted in our collection. And what ended up happening was, is um, I went back and looked at my footage while I was editing and I noticed that I'm like, are you kidding me? I saw the other Food Fighters and I didn't get them, but 
they tend to go quick and they normally have guns but this one didn't come with the guns but this right here this is full on nostalgia this is full on kid shit this is full on I gotta have it in my collection because it reminds this is going right next to my my old school Ninja Turtle figures that I've been slowly building up because those are like that's my childhood this is what made us who we are now you know you gotta remember there was no Rube the Great back then I was just some random dumbass kid <laughs> some random badass kid you know grew into the greatness but it's like all of us remember being a kid so that's all I got man to all my kids out there all my big kids all my little kids all the all my illegitimate kids not playing but to all my friends out there in this world kids at heart all those who rock and roll with me support this channel thank you you know Continue collecting what you want to collect. Continue finding those deals. Continue being a kid at heart. And continue passing on the greatness in the world. And no matter what you do in this world, and no matter what you do in life, be great at it. Continue on. I got some dope footage, dope clips I'm showing.